I want to start with the biggest question I guess I could possibly start with. The blockade of Qatar. Walk us through how that's actually affecting the UAE's maritime trade and its ports. Good morning to you and to your audience. Uh, uh, the uh, the uh, uh, Qatar issue is is uh, is uh, uh, as far as the uh, uh, infrastructure uh, uh, ministry and the strategy of uh, of our ports is a, a very minute issue, and we are not discussing it at all. Not at all. All right. Uh, well, walk us through some of the UAE's upcoming plans in terms of infrastructure spending then, because we've had some reports saying that you're looking to increase that spending. What's the thinking there? Yes, uh, uh, the infrastructure, uh, 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 as far as ports, uh, uh, airports, uh, uh, and uh, roads, uh, uh, Rail uh, is, is is actually uh, trending within within the region. Uh, as far as the ports, we are uh, 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 putting 25% uh, 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 of an investment over the 60 billion dollar worth of an investment that has been put in place uh, in the United Arab Emirates, and that is actually for the next uh, decade. So we are we are. We are looking into plans of improving our uh, port facilities uh, uh, during the next uh, uh, 10 years. Uh, talk to us about the financing that you envision as you seek to improve various infrastructure projects and transport developments here in the UAE. Is there scope, for instance, for more public-private partnership? Uh, no doubt that the uh, the uh, PPP issue is uh, is uh, trending today. It's it's not only in the United Arab Emirates, but uh, it's a worldwide uh, issue, and uh, we also have the private uh, private uh, private sector as a as a uh, as a partner uh, in most of our projects, whether it's an infrastructure project or or other projects. We are. Uh, driven by the private by the private sector, we are uh, we are a market-driven country, and uh, the private sector is 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 always or has always been considered as a as a partner for the for the uh, development of the United Arab Emirates. What's private sector appetite for financing these kinds of infrastructure projects like right now at the moment? It's a huge, uh, uh, tremendous. Uh, uh, many uh, uh, foreign investors, uh, m uh, many uh, 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 institutions are looking into uh, partnering with the, with us. Uh, we recently uh, getting into into uh, some uh, lighting uh, projects, and we have seen uh, offers from uh, uh, all over the world to. Uh, 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 probably put the new uh, street lighting on uh, on our uh, 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 road infrastructure in the United Arab Emirates, and that is uh, tremendous. And we've seen that a huge appetite for uh, investment within within the United Arab Emirates specifically and uh, on the region in general. New street lighting, that's exciting. Uh, we also had a report recently about Dubai planning to form a one billion shipping investment fund. Uh, walk us through the thinking there and what you might use that fund for. Uh, maybe uh, uh, I am not within the circle of uh, of, uh, of of such uh, such uh, a, a project, and uh, uh, I would have very little input to, to give you on this issue. Nonetheless, uh, any investment that is made uh, uh, within this United Arab Emirates is is actually uh, building on uh, the uh, stability of the business environment and the. Uh, 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 appropriate uh, st strategies that the government is, is putting forward for investors. So, so th whether this project or any other project is, 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 is having uh, 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 such, such a good climate for, for business within the United Arab Emirates. Your Excellency, since we're talking about the industry, the shipping industry, excuse me, uh, I noticed recently the UAE is the only Arab country to be bidding for Category B membership in International Maritime Organization's Executive Council. Why is that important to you? 
This is again uh, uh, probably a continuation of, of, of the previous question. Uh, uh, this is actually driven by the private uh, industry that we have, uh, ports within the United Arab Emirates, felt that they have, uh, they have uh, 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 to be within the council. And I always assume that the council uh, of the IMO is actually the kitchen where most of the legislation, rules, regulations are being uh, prepared. And with an industry that is uh, booming in, in the United Arab Emirates, uh, uh, the uh, industry felt that we, as a government, we should be as an incubator for their uh, willingness to become, uh, 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 for the United Arab Emirates to be a member uh, on, on the council. Um, one thing that the industry's requirement. Second, that we, we, we have a great infrastructure within the United Arab Emirates as far as the maritime. We are we are actually number three in the world as far as infrastructure, uh, as far as the very time is concerned. And, 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 and for that, we felt that we really need to, uh, to, be, to be on that big kitchen to, to participate in formulating the, uh, the uh, rules and regulation. The second part is the, 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 the legislation that we have, uh, the rules that we have, uh, the business environment that we have would actually be uh, a, a great incubator for, for, for us to be uh, uh, participating on, on a win-win situation with the council uh, of the IMO. We can provide them with, with, with what it takes to improve also their, their, their uh, uh, business environment. Uh, we also have, uh, uh, within the region, uh, uh, we have uh, uh, over 20 ports within the United Arab Emirates. Three of them are in the top 10 uh, uh, for the last uh, three executive years. So we have, we have uh, good reason to, to be part of the uh, 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 council. Uh, let's jump from sea to land transport then. I want to talk about the Gulf Rail project. Is that officially dead given the existing delays and the ongoing situation with Qatar? I don't know where we, uh, we, we got the idea of dead. Uh, uh, it is still uh, 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 a project and we, as far as the United Arab Emirates, uh, we are, uh, we've completed uh, uh, over uh, 266 kilometer of that uh, portion. We are negotiating now with the Saudi Arabia uh, uh, to, uh, to, to, to uh, uh, incorporate uh, their, their, their activities within. We are also arranging with uh, our, our neighbors, Omani, uh, as, as to continue with that. Nonetheless, as far as the rail within the United Arab Emirates, it's on the go, and we are uh, looking into options of executing it and the uh, portion of uh, execution. Your Excellency, looking at the whole of your remit, which is quite big, we have air, land, and sea transport. Give us a holistic, rough estimate of your upcoming financing needs. Uh, I would give you. Uh, uh, um, we're looking. We're looking into uh, uh, over 20 billion uh, uh, dollar of investment over the next decade uh, for 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 uh, uh, such industry. Well, most of it is going is going into the maritime. Uh, uh, the maritime industry is uh, is uh, is uh, well established in the United Arab Emirates, and we feel that we we should actually improve uh, uh, their status. Uh, within, within the United Arab Emirates, we have uh, uh, firm, we have uh, DP World, where, uh, where uh, they manage uh, more than uh, 57 uh, uh, ports and terminal worldwide. And with these, we, we really need to uh, put uh, uh, additional investment, additional strategies to uh, to, uh, uh, to improve uh, the, 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 the market as well. Uh, Abu Dhabi ports are also improving, improving the status of the port. The, the newly uh, Khalifa port has been, has been tremendous and it, it would require additional, additional uh, improvement. So the business in maritime, as far as the United Arab Emirates is flourishing and we are doing great on that, on that, on that side. Now, as far as the rail, uh, uh, now new strategies have to 
be uh, established. And probably by the end of the year, we would know who is participating on the uh, on the rail. As far as the road, we, we, we have uh, uh, over than uh, $8 billion of investment uh, over the next decade for improving our existing infrastructure and roads.